transmission temperature is a common one we get asked about and how to enter it in. It doesn't come up by default because it's not on the engine ECU, so it's not on a common OBD2 protocol. So this is why you normally have to enter in an extra, an extra setting in, which is called a PID. So this is for Torque Pro here, so this is the paid version of Torque, which will cost you around $10. Um, just going to make sure Bluetooth we're going to connect to OBD Oz which is our Bluetooth connector so then once you connect it up here hopefully this BT goes to a solid blue icon not a flashing one And so it's gone solid, so it's connected to the connector, and then once the car goes solid, that means it is connected to the ECU, and you can see the RPM has, RPMs have come up there. So now what we want to do is we want to head into settings, manage extra PIDs and settings, and you can see there's lots in here, but we want to go add custom. So you'll now be in the OBD2 PID editor page. This is the information you enter in here. Um, we will send you this information. But you can see up here we have a PID in a hex format, a name, short name, minimum value, maximum value. You can set that at whatever you want. It's just going to display them like the max. So we could set that at 160 because the transmission temperature isn't going to get over that. Scale factor, unit type, degree Celsius, equation, the header to use, and these other ones you normally don't need to use, unless it's a command one. Now just go test. Sorry, I put a 2 in there by mistake when I was touching the buttons. And you can see right here we've got the test result. We're picking up 47 degrees for our transmission temperature at the moment. So that's how you enter in an extra PID into the Torque app. And we did this one for a Toyota Prado here and for the transmission temperature.